for you key can remove iPhone passwords and Apple IDs. Links will be in the description down below. Hey guys, I device help here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I want to talk about iOS 13.4. I want to share with you guys additional new features and changes that I've come across after using Beta 1 for nearly 24 hours. Now, before we begin, I do want to talk about a major feature that's been added to CarPlay called Car Key. Now, Car Key enables users to unlock, drive, and share NFC keys with other devices this is a big feature coming to 13.4 for those vehicles that support carplay so really awesome feature there now if you didn't catch yesterday's coverage i talked about one of the biggest features coming to ios 13.4 which is icloud folder sharing this feature is now enabled as you can see there the share options are now visible if we take a look here at 13.3.1 that feature was not available as you can see there the share option was not visible before but now it is now there's some minor changes to the airpods air AirPods Pro user interface here. When you go to pair and you go to the menu, you now find the disconnect and forget device at the bottom of the list. Minor change, but definitely there. Again, 13.3.1 was at the top. 13.4, the menus are actually at the bottom. Now, if we continue here, we have nine new Memoji stickers. These will be available for all devices supported by iOS 13. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine new Memoji stickers again for all devices that support iOS 13. I also noticed a brand new toggle called Wi-Fi calling under system services. This was not here before, as you can see here, system services. It is right here underneath the system customizations right there. So, yep, that is something new. And there's also a button that's been moved around here. We also have improved maps at the bottom of the list has been removed to the actual maps extension. Now there's also something that's been moved around here before the announced messages with Siri is now on Siri in search, which was there before it was moved to the notifications panel and now back to the Siri in search. So go back into settings here. If we go to Siri in search, we find right there announced messages with Siri. And again, this used to be in the notifications tab, but it was first under the Siri tab. So Apple keeps switching it back and forth. So something new there as well. And last but not least, Apple continues to tamper with the menus and the mail application. If you are having issues with the emails application, Apple continues to work with the email application. We now have a brand new menu at the bottom of the screen. Again, 13.3.1 here, you see only a trash and reply button. On the left, we now see a full set of buttons here and controls to use with the emails application. So improvements all across the board here. Apple continues to improve iOS 13.4. And of course, I'll continue covering the software. So be sure to stay tuned. Make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for my weekly follow-up, which should be coming in the next couple of days. Thank you for watching, guys. Have a great day and I'll see you real soon. Peace.